communities across the state of California are struggling in the aftermath of Tuesday's heavy rainstorm. Counties to the north and the south of us uh, really be impacted by this rain with flooding and people displaced and uh, some real significant needs. Healthcare centers throughout dozens of counties are seeking support from direct relief. So crews are shipping out these emergency supplies as quickly as they can. <laughs> is uh, for one of our partners in Salinas. Uh, and then uh, the shipment over there is going to Los Angeles. Uh, we had a, one of our partner clinics have a roof collapse and flooding. All the way to PPE, mask gloves, for the people that are taking care of those individuals in shelters. Some of these pallets will be going to Watsonville where there was a major levee break. 3,500 uh, individuals were displaced. There's a major flooding in the community there. Uh, so we're sending supplies there and assistance to help that community. And the shipment to LA is more medication medical supplies, of PPE, and things like that. Direct Relief is also working with those who experienced flooding in Pajaro Valley. Just making sure that we're there for those individuals who need us. And that's like our continued effort, right? We want to be the beacon of hope, the resource that people can go to when they need assistance. It's very important for people to maintain their health care through disasters, and that's really why we're here, to make sure that, that people continue to get the care that they need for chronic conditions or for conditions that maybe are exacerbated by the flooding and the rainfall. Well, the direct relief team is projecting the need for emergency supplies to increase by this weekend. Live in studio, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti.